The White House issued a written statement yesterday afternoon, describing the official rationale for Donald Trump's decision to revoke former CIA Director John Brennan's security clearance. It's ostensibly from the president himself, it's written in first person, and it lists a litany of concerns about the former CIA chief, characterizing him as an erratic liar who makes outrageous allegations online and on television. There's no shortage of problems with Trump targeting one of his perceived enemies like this, but complicating matters is the fact that the official explanation is apparently incomplete. The president added an additional explanation for yesterday's announcement in an interview with The Wall Street Journal. In an interview Wednesday, Mr. Trump cited Mr. Brennan as among those he held responsible for the investigation, which also is looking into whether there was collusion between the Trump campaign and the Kremlin. Mr. Trump has denied collusion, and Russia has denied interfering. Mr. Brennan was director of the Central Intelligence Agency in the Democratic administration of former President Obama and one of those who presented evidence to Mr. Trump shortly before his inauguration that Russia had interfered in the 2016 election. I call it the rigged witch hunt. It is a sham, Mr. Trump said in an interview. And these people led it, he added. So I think it's something that had to be done. Oh, so the official explanation is that the president believes Brennan is an unhinged ideologue, but the explanation from Trump himself is that Brennan is connected to the investigation into the Russia scandal, which in the president's mind, means he must be punished. In fairness, it'd be helpful to see the full context of the exchange, as best as I can tell, the Wall Street Journal has not yet published a full transcript of the 20-minute interview, to fully appreciate the point Trump was conveying. That said, assuming the reporting is accurate, it looks like a classic example of Kinsley Gaff. The president made a mistake by accidentally telling the truth. What's more, let's not brush past the relevant details. Brennan, in his capacity as the director of the CIA, was directly involved with the initial response to Russia's attack on our elections, but his connection to special counsel Robert Mueller's criminal probe is incidental. It's not like Brennan has served in an investigatory role, digging into Trump and his political operations suspected wrongdoing. The distinction matters because it adds to clarity to the president's objections. He punished the former CIA chief, not because he's been part of Mueller's team, but because Brennan was part of the intelligence team that exposed the Russian attack. To hear Trump tell it, that role means that he had to retaliate against Brennan. In reality, he really didn't. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, please feel free to visit www.atthesmall.com once again that is www.atthesmall.com If you are seeking the best in facial and clear skin regiments and products for women and men including an opportunity to earn residual income, please visit our partner at www.jdro.myrnf.com all links are in the description box below. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall. We want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time, money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar. You can support us, and it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. Now if you are seeking the truth or guidance or need a prayer request or studies, please visit followyeshva.com at www.follow. Y. E. S. H. U. A. Now.com. Please note that we have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below. Please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.